everybody, Jaws Jr. here. Now that the Maui series is done, we're home back at the world headquarters of Jaws Jr. Entertainment and starting a exciting project. Well, for me anyway. So, let me show you something here. Sorry about that sun there. Show you something here. See this? That means I got my permit to build the shop. So what we're doing now is we're starting the process of clearing out all of this stuff over here so we can put the shop in right where I'm standing basically. And uh, man, I'm excited. We've been living here for 14 years. And I've been wanting this thing since the day we moved in instead of, I'm not going to even show it to you, it's an embarrassment. Uh, the existing freestanding garage that's about ready to fall down. I have been fighting my local municipality for a year to get this thing approved. And so, once we got that approval done, it sailed right through the county. So they've got a couple little minor things on there. They're not restrictions. They are basically notes. And I've already got my contractor lined up. He's going to get me some final numbers this, uh, within the week. And hopefully by Labor Day, the shop will be done. Or to the point where I can start doing what I want to do with it. So for now, we're gonna just I'm gonna put you up here on the tripod and have you watch me take out these bushes. Now I screwed up. I was gonna have you guys be here and when I did the rest of them, or when I started this process. So I was gonna have you be here with that for the ultimate groundbreaking. Well, I was excited about getting this done and actually I just literally forgot about it so this fence is coming down these bushes as you can tell are going to be gone those bushes that grapevine which we already have starts off of and they're growing that apple tree is coming down and then we put up a temporary deer fence and how this is going to be is right there where this weed thing is growing approximately right here is the corner then it goes up to that post right there that's the corner then it goes out 30 feet so basically the shop is going to be 30 feet by 30 feet 900 square feet of floor space and it's going to be 16 foot tall and that's so I can put in a sizable lift in here in the future because part of this is to rebuild old green so just over two years ago when I started this channel that's what the purpose of the channel was going to be for was to document the process of building this shop All of this is going to be gone. Yay! And now I can actually start doing what I was intending to do with this channel. In addition to our rock hunting adventures, in addition to any other place I decide to go, and in addition to whatever else I happen to tape, pull out the camera for and video and, and upload for everyone to see. So this is probably the worst that this yard's ever going to look after I get done today and tomorrow it probably won't look much worse which means only room for improvement but yeah that's a fire bush and it's just too big to transplant or for me to transplant and then I've already taken out some boxwoods and this boxwood here is next then this fire plant fire bush 
and then take down the railings pull the posts get in here to take out that grapevine pull out the so-called framework very very that was put in when we first moved here because we just needed something to put up put up on put stuff up on and then where that horrible looking table is at there's actually a concrete pad there and that's got to get broken out and of course the fence line behind that and then our direct tv dish has got to get moved or i'll fire direct tv and go with i think we have something like that spectrum or charter or whatever so i'm going to put you guys up here have you stand here and watch me pull out these next two bushes Hey everybody, it is now the next day. We're working on steer, still the tear out project. So we got all the bushes out of here, off to a burn pile. Now we're removing fence posts with a handyman jack, a broken tie down strap, a chain, and old green, a 79 square body, how we remove posts. That you have no support to put a jack here next to it, to put a jack here next to it to lift this out. Now it's already broken loose a little bit. And we've already pulled the biggest post out of them all, which is right here. It's a few days later from the last clip that you just saw and now I have somebody who wanted to have some demolition in his life. And let me tell you, he's a swinging it. Got this thing whooped. Look at that. Well, everybody, there we go. 
teenager who was bigger than I am, and I'm six foot four, asked him if he wanted to do something like swing a sledgehammer. And an hour and a half, or an hour later, <laughs> look, look at the result. Well, it's a couple days later. We have that knocked out, as you just seen. And we're going to take this post out. I cannot get the truck backed up here to use the bumper square with it. So, it worked on those. So, we, what we do is as I just wrap a no-good tie-down strap around that. And I'm going to start jacking up. That's just to hold the jack up. It's a, my third hand. So there you go, these are out. This one is sad to remove though. These are paw prints from our two old pugs that we had. That's from Muggsy and Pebbles. Well, Everything here is cleaned out, ready for the construction to start. The Jaws Junior Mobile Entertainment Command Center is off at a temporary home, and everything that's left here will be taken out by equipment. So, again, the corner of the shop will be here, and it's going to be, this is all the edge of it. And it goes to right there. And it goes straight across and back up to that corner. So, very soon, there'll be equipment. Moving a little bit of dirt, doing a stem wall foundation. And then the building gets put on top of that. And then a concrete floor, entry pad. The door will be right in, see there's, there's the marker. The door will be in this area. And then we'll still have the path about as wide as that gate, a little bit wider than that gate, leading down to the side yard. All this will be taken care of. The world headquarters of Jaws Junior Entertainment will soon be started. Well, thank you for watching this uh, tear out portion of the video. There'll be a lot more coming as the construction of the shop is underway. Gets underway, and I want to take all of you along with it 
and just take you along for the ride so you can see what's going on. I'm not going to be able to explain all the construction details with you, but I'll take as much video and pictures and, sh and that should be able to show you what's going on. So for now, everybody, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine, waiting for a new shop to get built. This is the Adventures of Jaws Jr. Have a good, have a good one, everybody. See ya.